Anderson, recording again from the Motorhome Studios. And this week has been a, uh, a fun week as well. Uh, last week of finals uh, at, the, at school. So glad to get that over with. So that means that this coming up week, I should have more time to get more work done. And uh, just be able to pursue different priorities in the meantime. So at least until the next semester starts. Uh, it was a great uh, semester. Got to learn a lot. Uh, I loved writing some of these extra little stories in the creative writing class. This past week, I was also able to put a lot of time into making the promotional video for The Mans, The Dragons, The Gods, which is now available on uh, CreateSpace, Amazon, and Kindle. As I promised last week, uh, I would get that out for this week, so that is complete. This is a great book. It details the history of the gods, the creation of the dragons, creation of the entire universe, solar system, and on-demand kind. So, very intriguing. It is the basis knowledge for the entire Dragon Bell series. So, with this book, uh, it brings to understanding why things are the way they are, and why people act the way they do, uh, why the dinosaurs really aren't here anymore, um, as well as the dragons. Since uh, they came, they were here, they kind of had precedence on this earth, and now they're gone, and mankind is the, the, the reigning type of creature here on earth. So, excellent book. It's a short one. It's just around 80 pages long. It should only take about an hour to two hours to read it from cover to cover. Uh, a lot of information, but not that big. So, uh, please visit the, uh, the video here on the YouTube. You can go to dragonbells.com and uh, watch it from there as well. And, uh, to add to my um, step one of the goal process, I came up with a new goal that I want to pursue. Along with everything else, it kind of, like everything else, incorporates with everything else. Um, in that I love teaching. I love watching people learn and uh, educate themselves. Uh, that's what I love about going to school myself as well. And after I made this last video, uh, I've showed it to a few people, and they're like, wow. Where did you learn to do that? And I was like, well, truthfully, I, I learned most of it on my own. However, I did write the Dragon Bells pretty much on my own as well, uh, just with help from Bell on the idea side. But when I went back and took this creative writing class, it brought in a whole lot of new ideas, different ways to do the same thing, uh, and, and to make it better and to improve the, uh, the product that I'm putting out. Everything I have done for the Dragon Bell series from writing the books, creating the characters. Um, I have a character log of all the characters who will be in the Dragon Bell series, from dragons to the, the wolves that Sliverballs has, uh, to Guy, Phoenicia, Big D, and so many others. Uh, many dragons here in the terrestrial realm and the telestial realm, as well as the gods. And uh, I've got over 15 pages just in names and descriptions of the people. Uh, and so from there I've been able to write the stories and then create all this music for it that I've uh, that you've been hearing in some of these uh, last videos uh, some of them are free download music uh, that I do get online so I'm not infringing copyrights because that's not nice if you do that um, but to create it it's been a lot of fun in some of my earlier vlogs I went over the LMMS software and I have gone over the Caden Live software that I use to make these vlogs with every single week. And um, as you saw at the beginning of this video, the, the Frainer Dragon, I use that as part of these vlogs to show my uh, goal setting process. I would really love to go out and help teach these uh, softwares to people. So many people, especially uh, family and friends who I visited up in Utah over Thanksgiving, there's like, I'm writing a book, how do I do this, how do I do that, and how do I get promoted, how do I get out there. Uh, so I want to create a kind of private school business where these things are taught. Um, it doesn't cost money for an education, it takes your initiative to get your education. When I use these softwares, I know I get ridiculed by uh, especially my sister, she's a Big Mac fan. And uh, for being a uh, open source uh, Ubuntu kind of guy. But I've done all of this for virtually nothing. 
I just purchased a brand new HP Pavilion at the beginning of the semester uh, to help me get through because I needed a, a more powerful processor for these vlogs. I uploaded Ubuntu, which is a free operating system, and then I downloaded uh, the Caden Live, Blender, uh, Vectorscape, uh, LibreOffice. All of those come free, and it's just taking the time to do it and having a mentor to maybe help you through. So I wanted to start a education forum where I can help other people learn these things. One of my most favorite parts in the creative writing class was reading other people's stuff, getting excited about it. As a group, we would start talking about some of these ideas, and we started getting invested with our ideas into their story. It made it so much fun, uh, and uh, just collaborate with everybody back and forth. So I want to create a forum where that is available, to teach people how to write, to teach people how to develop their characters. and. Um, in the creative writing class, one of the other students came to me and said, how did you write your character this way? And I showed him that uh, file of all my characters and their self-esteem levels and their backgrounds, their histories, what excites them, what makes them mad, all these different things uh, that make it so exciting when you read the character. I had a lot of fun with the uh, Blender uh, animations. So if you know anybody who is involved in teaching these kind of things, Please send them my way. I am trying to put something together, making it something incredibly different and new. Taking today's technology, and not at the cost of, um, I do love Photoshop. I did take a Photoshop class a couple semesters ago, and that's where I learned to do my, a lot of the art that is on the books, like uh, the new book, uh, The Mans, The Dragons, The Gods. That was techniques I learned in the class. My business cards, all the pictures on Facebook and Twitter and uh, my Google Plus pages, all of that was learned at that class. Um, I prefer GIMP, which is of course the open source equivalent to Photoshop. Uh, a few variances in there, but there's very few things that I can't do with GIMP that I can do with Photoshop. And, and there's a, a, a lot of free resources out there and I want to help people tap those so they can set their goals and they can move forward and make something productive. Um, after going through the divorce, losing my gym, uh, those were the most important things in my life at that time and, and they fell apart, they were gone. I had to lean onto something and me and Belle came up with the Dragon Bell series. Uh, granted, yeah, I do most of the work, but without her inspiration and her help and uh, the desire to uh, do something for Belle, that's what brought all of this about. If you saw my Facebook post, I'm looking at a huge project. Um, everything I do is huge. Uh, several years ago, around 2005 or 6, I actually had accumulated $96 million from uh, investors to promote a, a sports mall, was what I called it. And it was a huge project. And I've done it once before. I can do it again. This time I am on the emphasis of the arts, the visual creations, the multimedia, uh, web design, all of this other uh, stuff that is helping me bring the Dragon Bell series alive. I have these ideas and I figure out ways to work them and how to figure them out. Um, the difference with this one is I will be looking for investors, just like I did before, and it is to convince others my idea is going to be beneficial to so many people that it can become profitable. So that will be a big difference in where I'm trying to go today. As well, this past week, I am excited. I have hit 499 followers on Twitter. So if you're on my Twitter page, thank you very much. I've had a couple people uh, retweet some of my things, uh, favorite some of my comments and videos that I've been posting up. I really do appreciate it. Please continue to share. Uh, as well, subscribe to this channel because every week I am doing another new vlog. Uh, this is part of the fun that I do for the, the Dragon Bell series. As you uh, think about some of the talents that you can send to me, what you've done, what you're working on, uh, I sure do hope that all of you have another great week.